It's time for What's New, the show that features the latest developments in the software industry that are driving innovation today. What's New is on the air right now. Hi, I'm Kelly Lohman. I'm the Vice President of Marketing at Ingenium Care. We're going to show you our product based on Windows 7. It's a remote home health care monitoring system. It works for residences as well as facilities. So the Ingenium Care system interfaces into the end user's home or room if they're in a, a managed care facility. It connects to emergency alerts. The family can have two-way communication with the, with the person under care or with the, um, uh, excuse me, and to the family itself or to their um, doctor or home or care provider. You can simply touch and make phone calls. Everything's built on the platform for large, easy to read buttons. You can make phone calls by simply uh, picking a, a photograph and it dials the number. We can interface um, both on the uh, administrative side, we can push calendar events out and they can find um, calendar appointments very easily. We can send them health and treatment reminders. We can do this by simply pushing it through the system or we can alert them in other ways. It's attached through a, uh, a Zigbee device that is um, in partnership with Control4, one of our uh, home automation partners. So if there's something very important or someone needs a different level of care, we can uh, make an alert such as uh, such as the uh, lights going on and off in a home or making the phone ring. Of course. So we can allow internet access, fun things, we can push uh, photographs, we can give them music to listen to, and anytime anything's new, the, the buttons light up or we can light something up in the house. So it's very easy. We can interface also with their safety and comfort features, which is uh, the door locks or any of the webcams we can have set up through the home. We can set um, safety and comfort features for them, which interacts with their lighting scenes and temperature environmental controls. The user can control all this themselves, but if they're unable to use it, they um, can let the caregiver set this up remotely from anywhere in the world. We can send emergency uh, messages through the system with predefined subjects Let's say she feels terrible and they can just simply send a message to the caregivers and they'll um, be able to get that message. So this is primarily the system. It's uh, really easy to use. Anything that they need to do is on the home screen here and if there's something that comes up they have a little uh, message box here and um, this one says that uh, Eula AKA Bunny has um, some blood pressure um, to take. And so she ha puts on a simple Bluetooth cuff, walks up to the system, it grabs it automatically and she presses done and it records into, into the system. And any appointments that come up um, illuminate and like I said before, can either do something subtle if she doesn't need a lot of care or it can uh, light uh, lights on and off or, or at different uh, levels of alerts or voice interaction and uh, we can also see her through this webcam on the screen or there's webcams that we can push uh, around the home if needed we can interface into those as well so next we're working on a pendant that utilizes Windows 7 sensor platform the pendant is an emergency pendant that will be used by an elderly or disabled person that will detect all kinds of things like falls. It has a voice interaction um, sensor in there so if someone falls and they can't actually activate a button to push, they can talk to the system and ask if it's okay, uh, ask if you're okay and if, um, if you need help. And if you don't answer or if you respond um, yes, it will send someone over to help you out. Um, so we have developed this um, this device over this past week and we, are, we have a little um, guy here that shows how the sensor might work in the pendant that we're developing. Of course this will be miniaturized when it goes to market, but let's say someone um, falls forward, 
you can see this remotely on any of our administrative views. So if something happened and you just wanted to check in on your mother, you can um, certainly see um, any movement remotely. So instead of having an actual webcam trained on someone, if somebody doesn't want that, they can just um, get, gather what's happening with that person by using the sensor in our pendant that will be going to market soon. Thank you for watching the Ingenium Care system built on Windows 7 platform.